okay. If you do this stuff on the interview, you should be fine. Because again, software engineers think that their skills 100% translate to a data engineer. Now, if you're a software engineer, what you need to know is that the interview is slightly different than if you are a data engineer. You might not need to know as much Python or leak code or object oriented programming language you still need to know some but that's not all of it you're going to have a data molly mock interview you're going to have a system design mock interview an etl product based mock interview things that you will probably need to do some mock interviews either with a friend or a mentor whoever it is but if you have a friend who's a data engineer hit them up get them to do a mock interview with you and get them to teach you okay if you do this stuff on the interview you should be fine because again software engineers Think that their skills 100% translate to a data engineer mock interview or a real interview. It's probably like 50% of the way there. So that's the good news. The good news is that most software engineers can move over to a data engineer position very, very, very quickly because there's already a lot of overlap, but it isn't perfect. You have to make sure you study for the interviews and you should be fine from there.